Hi children, hope you all are doing well. So today we will learn subtraction with borrow part two. Okay, let's start. What does subtraction mean? Subtraction means when we remove one number from another is called subtraction, right children? So when we have a question, what is the first thing we'll see? We'll see the sign, right? So here we have minus. So we know that we will be doing subtraction or removal. So first we will circle the sign. Okay, so when minus is there, we will remove one number from another, right? Now, next we need to know which digit is in which place. So write ones, tens, and hundreds. Okay, children. Now, which side do we uh, start first? We will always start from ones, then we move to tens, then hundreds, right? So we will do this subtraction with the help of blocks. Okay, let's draw the blocks. Okay, ones, tens, hundreds. So how many ones we have? Five ones, so five blocks of ones. And four tens, so four blocks of tens. And three hundreds, so three blocks of hundreds. Okay, children. Now, now what we need to do, we will start removing from one side, right? So we need to remove eight from five. So we need to subtract. So can we remove children? No, right? Because we have only five blocks. We cannot cut eight blocks from five, right? So what do we do? We can borrow one ten from tens place. Okay. So when we borrow this one ten from tens place, we will get ten ones, right children? Because one ten will have ten ones. So when we borrow one ten, we will have ten ones. So ten ones plus we have five more, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So total 15 ones we have. So now from 15, we can remove 8, right? Yes, we can remove. So now here we don't have this 110 because we borrowed, okay? So what did we do, children? Because we cannot remove 8 from 5, we borrowed 110 from 10's place. So when we borrowed 110 from 10's place, we got here 15 ones, right? So from 15, we can remove 8. Now, because we borrowed 110, here before we had only 4 tens. But now because we borrowed 110, we will have 3 tens. Okay, children? Now, so let's start subtraction. So we will uh, remove 8 from 15. Let's cut 8 blocks, okay? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So when we remove eight blocks, how many are left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So seven ones are left. So I will write seven under ones, okay? Now, in tens, what do we need to do? We need to remove two from three, right? Because we borrowed one ten, we have only three tens now. So we need to remove two. So one, two, three, we have from three tens. If we remove one, two, how many are left? One ten is left. So we will write one in tens. Okay. Now, here we have three hundreds. Do we have any a digit to remove children? No, right? We don't have anything to remove. So we will write three as it is. So we got the answer 317. Okay, children. So like this, you need to do subtraction. Let's see another example. So what is the first thing we'll see? We'll see the sign. So here we have minus. So we know that we will be doing subtraction. Okay. Next, we need to know which number is in which place. So I'll write ones, tens, and hundreds. Okay. So first we will start from ones, right, children? So this also we will do with the help of the blocks. Okay. So ones, tens, and hundreds. So how many ones we have here? Four ones, so four blocks of ones and seven tens, so seven blocks of tens and two hundred, so two blocks of hundred, okay? Now, we need to remove five from four. Can we do that, children? Can we remove? No, right? We, here we have only four blocks of ones. So we can't cut five. So what do we do? We can borrow one ten from tens place, okay? So when we borrow 110 from 10's place, we will get 10 ones, right? So 10 ones plus 
Here we have one, two, three, four. So 10 plus four, 14 ones we have now, right? So for, from 14, we can remove five, right? Yes, we can remove. So what did I do? Because I cannot remove five from four, I borrowed one 10 from tens place. So when I borrowed one 10 from tens place, here I got 14 ones now. From 14, I can remove five, right? Now here in tens place, before I had seven tens, because I borrowed one 10, now I have only six tens, okay? So six tens, okay? Let's do. So this 10 is not there because we borrowed. Now we need to remove five from 14. Now let's cut five blocks. One, two, three, four, five. So how many are remaining? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So nine ones are remaining. So I will write nine under ones, okay? Now I need to subtract two from six, right children? Because we borrowed one 10, we have only six tens now. So I need to remove two tens means I will cut one, two. So when, when I remove two blocks of tens, how many are left? One, two, three, four. Four tens are left, right? So I'll write four. Okay. Next, here in hundreds place, we have two. Do you have anything to remove? No, right? So I will write two as it is. So I got the answer. 249. When we remove 25 from 274, we got answer 249. Okay, so like this, we need to do subtraction. So I will send you the questions. You can do it in your notebook and send me the picture. Okay, children. Thank you. Take care. Bye.